All right, I'm on my way to go get the Amavig prescription. This will be my second dose and it's an auto injector. Um, they store it in the refrigerator. So <laughs> it gets kept in a refrigerator and then you take it out and then you administer it after it's been 30 minutes since being inside the refrigerator. So I will show you how we inject the Amavig up close and personal. <laughs> I can feel that it's cold, which is really funny. <laughs> but all right, so now we wait 30 minutes and then I'm gonna show you how to put this medication in my body. All right, I am here with my Amavig medication. This is what it looks like. So mine is 140 milligrams for one dose. You do this every 28 days and it's called an auto injector. It comes with the information and this is what the actual medication looks like here. You can see this clear window. You, uh, they say to always check and make sure there's it's not cloudy and it's see-through. That's how you know that you have the medication already. So mine's looking good and uh, we'll be ready to inject that. And then just so we look together, these are the instructions right here. So I'm gonna read them to us. It says, prepare and clean your injection site. So I'm gonna be using my thigh today. That's where I prefer to. And then it says to pull the orange cap off only when you are ready to inject. Do not leave the orange cap off for more than five minutes. This can dry out the medicine. So when I'm ready, I'm gonna take this off. Okay, so I'm gonna stretch this skin out like this and I'm gonna inject the medication right there into my thigh. And when this yellow safety guard hits my skin, we will hear it inject, like it'll click. And then after that, the window is gonna turn yellow, letting us know that the medication has been administered and we are all ready to go. This is the information on it. It gives you a lot of information. It's more details, but I am just gonna go ahead and show you guys how I do this. So I'm gonna clean my leg off and then we'll get started. All right, I'm not gonna lie. I'm feeling, feeling a little worried here. It'll be fine. I've done this before, but okay, here we go. So I got just literally stretching my skin out where I'm going to inject. I don't know. They said you could pinch it as well, but I think I'd rather just stretch it out. So here we go. We're going to do it, y'all. We're going to do it right now. <laughs> Every month I do, <laughs> I feel like I'm going to do this. I psych myself out. It's really not bad. I just psych myself out. It's so crazy. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna try to make let you guys see this clear area right here because when I'm done, it'll turn yellow. So let's do it. Here we go. If you guys can see the yellow come out. Okay, I think I did it. All right, I did good that time. You can see it's all yellow. That means the medicine did go in. So I'll show you guys, but it's really not bad at all. So here's Just the a little prick. You could see some blood, but I'll wipe that off and it'll be like it never happened. I really hope you enjoyed watching me stab myself in the leg. <laughs> Just kidding. But honestly, I really hope you enjoyed this video or maybe it helped you. I look forward to doing a video to discuss my progress. If I've noticed any results. So stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe. I look forward to talking to you next week. See ya.